Ooh, we are going deep inside the factory. Oh, look, a Twain. Found the subway system. All right. Nothing to the left, so let's go right. Now, the question is, what are they using all these people for? Is it labor? Ah, oh, shit. We got some dogs. Mmm. Nice doggy. Nice doggy. Nice doggies. Nice doggies. Don't mind me, just walking on by. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. That one's far away, so I don't think it's that big of a deal. I've avoided drowning so far, and let's keep it that way. Hmm, don't see anything underwater to grab. Shit! No, 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 no! Arr! Fuck! Oh, man. Oh. <laughs> The dogs do be making me cool crunch. Alright, is this a... Ha! Alright. That's not the trick at play here. But I need to do something to get more distance. What can I do? Hmm. If I get the dog's attention, and then I... Oh, I might... Okay, I think I might know what I need to do. So if I get the dog's attention, and then come back to the water... Oh no, the dog can swim! Um, but can you dive? <laughs> Fuck me, did we drown? Ha! <laughs> ah! Uh. All right, so I think the water is the right choice. We just have to not breathe it. Come on, doggy. Come on. Come on. You get it to come all the way over here. I think we are faster than it. I'm not sure if this is the right play, however. Oh, it seems like it is. Get fucked. Ah, oh, fuck! Shit, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, this is stressful. Oh, I hate this. 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 I hate this.
Ch -ch 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 long, long snake. Long, long snake. Hey, Durango. Wow. Holy shit, seven months. The fact that the machinery also gets louder is terrifying. Fuck. Off! Ugh. Oh, okay. Alright, let's take a second. This for... Can't believe. It's heaven. I, I am, I'm still flabbergasted. Just... It's never... I don't know. I try to make everything... Everything always available. No matter what for people. Because I don't... I don't like gating people behind required stuff, so like, you know, all the emotes are on BTTV and all that stuff, but it's still, I don't know, it still feels weird that someone just likes, likes the shenanigans, or I guess, or likes the emotes, almost that they uh, subscribe for so long. Well, thank you, during our <laughs> Aha! Grand Theft Submarine. Checkmate. Now what are we... Are they... Is this like a, uh, an Evangelion situation? Did they dig deep? Are they, like, exploiting something? Um... What is that? Uh, I think it's just, like, hovering in place. Oh! Oh, it has, like, a charge attack. The fact the camera zooms out. Oh, this is beautiful. I, f I fucking love scenery porn like this. Just the scale of things. We're this tiny speck in this grand machine. Oh, what do we got here? Kind of weird that a submarine has like a uh, its its method of traversing through things is just smash. I feel like you kind of you you sort of risk your submarine. All right, gamer tradition: you always go the opposite direction of the way you need to first. All right, and all right, there's nothing over there. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I should have equipped this submarine with axes. That's kind of a freaky, deaky little light. So this place get flooded? Oop. Maybe we need to hit higher up on the crack? Alright, maybe one more hit. Aya! No? What about one more hit now? Was the crack a trick? Wait, can I launch myself out of the water? Whee! <laughs> 
That's kind of fun. Ah! Hydrate. Fine. Fine! <sighs> Delicious. Alright, so maybe we knock the holes big enough for us to swim through. I'm wondering if we are just going to, like, pull a lever to open that door, and then we use the submarine to leap. You know, kind of like a, we salmon it. Just leap out of water. No, no, it's like we're just continuing on. Unless... The rats. The rats. We are the rats. It's a good thing we keep finding these things, so we can only worry about going left to right. It'd be really weird if we had to go forward and or back. Alright, we see stuff in the background. Let's see, is this a camera of something? What's this? A broken window. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Dodge! Alright, I was not expecting to get Indiana Jones there. I feel like it missed, it missed a uh, opportunity for sudden dramatic music. Well, that button's crushed. Ooh, plants. Oh, it's the trees and the machines. Oh, this is one of those sphere things, no? I see. We can get our Monsanto approved dose of glyphosate. Mmm, delicious. Whee! Oh! Huh! Nope. Didn't, didn't do it right. Let it charge, and then. Yup! There you go, boy. Good thing we're light enough that it can uh, lift us up. Let's see. We went into a machine. We've gone down, down, down. And now we're... There's a bunch of plants and stuff down here. Bean time. <laughs> Ooh, we gotta make it through here. And we have another button. I wonder if those trees, ah, okay, I was right. We do need to take our machine with us. So there's probably something, oh fuck! What was that? Okay, let's just, let's just not mind that. It's just, uh, it's just, uh, just a thing, you know? It's just normal, normal underwater thing. It's no problem. It's fine, really. Ah, not what I meant to do. Get back, get back. Whee! All right, we're, we're a little bit too close. That's a good thing the submarine controls are so simple. It's 
So though even a child can control it. So it seems like this had to have been a facility of some kind that later got flooded. Hmm. Well, we need to push a button. I'm concerned that this is a way to get us out of the submarine and we're about to get spooked again. Get in! Okay, we're doing we're doing this again, buddy. I see how it is. Promise? <laughs> no! <laughs> don't do it! <laughs> no, don't separate me from my submarine! Oh, it's even worse. I think we have to f we have to drive our submarine and then bring the water down. So we're gonna have to swim even further. Oh, I hate this so much. Oh, I don't like this. Whatever this is, this is I'm not gonna like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I want to stay in the nice, safe submarine where I can ram people. Okay. We can get over here. And then we need that door to be open. Fuck. Alright, let's get the submarine as close to me as possible. But on the other side of that damn pipe. Oh, wrong place. Let's uh, catch our breath. Alright, we hit the button. I don't like this, I don't like this, let's get the fuck out of here. I don't like this, I don't like this, here's the submarine. Alright. We're safe once again, my friends. We've made it to the safety the submarine. Yeet! Imagine those two guys that we stole the submarine from are very confused right now. It's like, I, I parked it right there. I swear. What the f fuck? No! No! Oh, I don't like that. I thought it was a squid. Oh, that's a person. I see. They don't like light. If I shine the light on them for a few seconds, I get some time to go. No, no, no! Alright, if they get too close, then there's not much I can do. Noted. Stay the heck away from me. So stay awake! At least I can use the boost to travel instead, and that can work. Oh no! Stay the fuck away from me. Ah. No! No! We got stunned! Are you fuck? That was bullshit.
Area transition. No, get out! Get out of the submarine! I feel like I need to hit that and then get out of the submarine because it knocks loose a piece of wood. The problem is, is that my character just isn't getting out. I see what I need to do. That's right. Back! Back! Alright. Gotcha. Noted. I'm glad that is the very last time we will see one of those. Yep. The very last time. We will not ever see... A spooky thing underwater once again. Oh, hold on. Always gotta check the wrong way first. Gotta go the wrong way just to go right. Sometimes two steps back will let you leap three steps forward. But you'll never know unless you go off the beaten path to so take a chance. It might be better to like, take a chance. And you'll enhance life more than you'll know. Was a waste of time, but that is a risk we take while gaming. I'm kind of surprised nothing was hidden over there. Usually when you have a, a, a distance that long, you put something. Alright. Let's see how far we can beach this. Clunk. Alright. Alright. Uh, it's in the sand. Not much we can do now. This is a big land if we're underwater. These are some huge facilities. This is a very ominous wall. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, I don't like that. Ow. Hey, buddy, you want to help me? All right, I guess not. I guess we're a little too weak. We finally hit a downside being a child. Our noodly little arms are incapable of uh, lifting giant grates. Alright, I feel like this is like where a mech battle happens. Just a boss fight. What is that booming noise? Alright, we can't shift that. What else do we have? Nineteen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Eighteen. Okay, we either need more or less people. Oh, we need 19 more people to be on that button. I see. Okay, we got this now. We're gonna be gathering a lot of people, it looks like. 
I feel like we're gonna have a portable mind control device because I don't see any other way this will this puzzle is gonna work. Or we could have like a mine cart where we pile a bunch of people into it. I see. Oh, come on! Fuck you! Hmm. Okay. There is a device. You just need to get up to it. Interesting. Um, nope, we gotta go more diving. Hate that for me. Thankfully, I don't see any weird squid people. Seems like it's going to be our most complex puzzle yet. We've got multiple areas. I don't know if that means we're getting close to the end? I don't know how long this game is. I do think it's kind of like Little Nightmares and that it's going to be like a one stream game. But I don't know if it's going to be like six hours or if it's going to be shorter. I say six hours is a one stream game. For Fridays, that is basically how oh, it works with me. <laughs> Alright. <gasps> I was right! Come with me, comrades. I will lead us. Wait, can they lift me up? They can! Good job, minions! Do not fall. Yes, come to me. Okay, now that we have these people, we can go get... Um... Not there. Let's check to the left of this area. Kind of a. Uh, I wonder. That's some kind of daylight. I don't know. All right, everyone, grab and pull. Okay. Oh, I hear someone snoring. I feel like it's gonna be dangerous. Hold on, I need a, a little bit to the left, everyone. Alright, I hope we don't have to worry about a security guard. Alright, I don't see anything over there. Alright, let's get in that minecart. Oh, they fucking pushed it! Damn it, guys! Alright, so let's pull it. Alright, so let's make sure this time we don't walk past it, because even if they're off screen, it looks like they will be doing stuff. Interesting. Even without pressing the grab button, they did it. Alright, so we need to drop down into that, have them push us. Put your backs into it! Yes! Good job, my minions! 
Ooh, we see that red wire. Um... Do I climb up? Oh, why was it... Alright. Okay, game. Be that way. That was kind of weird. Ooh. That's some... Interesting... Was it? Slate? Kind of angular like that? Alright, do I just need to, like, get close to those people to control them? Uh, what the heck? Hmm. What if I do this? That is the opposite of what I need to do. Noted. And okay, what if I just don't get on it at all? Then I do this. I think this will give me enough height. Oh! We get three more! I have freed you! Now you are my growing army. Hey, and these guys actually have some helmets. Nice, good, good, good workplace safety thinking, you guys. You know, all these other people, you know, they, uh, they didn't really get their hard hats. Actually, hold on. Aha! We just needed a little bit of help. And then we just break our ankles. Just like that. <laughs> now, do you think if I'm, con if I'm connected to their brains, do they all just suddenly snap their own ankles? I don't think so. I wonder how it works, though, with multiple brain control devices. Like, we saw that we could daisy chain, but, like, what if there's... Two different people with devices on. Do they, like, fight over it? <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Seriously? Oh. I see, I've alerted the dog, I need to run away. Okay. Hey, hold on. Where's the trigger for the dog? Oh. I see. Um... Do I need to move quietly? Obviously something over here, but I I can't think of how to bypass the dog. Maybe there's something else that we get and then we come back here. It's enough to know that this place exists and that we have um, opened it up, so to speak, so I can go through it. 
we can maybe revisit this later. There is another level I have not been to yet. Uh, hold on. Before we leave, let's go ahead and reset this. Question is, if I have more people... Nope. Okay, so yeah, I did th that's definitely a situation that we can miss it. Because we need those extra bodies to open that thing up. So, we got that solved. The tricky thing is just going to be making sure I don't... ...advance too far to where I can't go back. Let's see. I wonder if I get something that will... Make the dogs not hostile to me anymore. Like, I bet if I had one of the... Maybe it's like one of the masks. It will... Make them ignore me? Or maybe it's a scent thing? I mean, it's a dog, so obviously a scent thing. Always... An option. Alright, we got those people. Um... Alright, everyone. I see. I think I just get them to throw me over there. Puppies! Uh, what? Ah, I didn't do it fast enough. We gotta have it have momentum so it goes all the way over. There we go! I love how they ragdoll and they just kind of flop. <laughs> Alright, now we need to check the upper area. Because I think we basically cleared the bottom and middle of all the bodies. So let's see what upstairs has in store for us. Here we go, me and my army of minions, gonna show them what mind control can do. Can do a lot of things, like throwing small childs. Manual labor. Ding dong. Free my people from their cage. By that, I mean we just, just push. Just do a little push. I'm sure they're fine. We'll be okay. They're resilient. And look, we have two supervisors here. You can tell them by their little hard hats. Ah! I'm getting used to holding down the grab button just in case there's anything to interact with. Um, all right. Oh! All right, what do we have over here? They're ragdolling. This person... Hey, the question is, will they animate or will they stay dead? Hmm. 
I want to see. I want to see what the big thumping is doing. That pipe is getting... Something's going through the pipe. Now, if that body stays dead, I'm thinking I need to bring it with me and use it to distract the dogs. But if it comes alive, then I'm not exact. Oh, no. Hmm. Yeah, I am confused. Hey guys! What's up? Y'all doing okay? Yeah? Yeah, alright. Hey, we got another supervisor! Look at those little hard hats. It is interesting that it would be really easy for the game to... Ah! I spin! Hey Aurora, welcome on by. I hope your Friday is shaping up to be great. Yep, and then this body will be the last person for the button. Cool, the door opened. Oh, fuck me. Did I just... I was literally just talking about not going to a place of... Uh, hold on. Can I reload? Interesting. So it looks like we're halfway through the game. Fuck. Um... Do we want to reload and try to get past that dog section? That's the question. That's the question. I mean, we found the secret thing. But how do we take advantage of it? Um. Hey, what's going on, Hassan Scoopa? Secret what? We found an area where we could pull off the boards, and it looks like the yellow wire was going down there, and we found that. <laughs> Yep, that's a squeaky hinge, all right. Someone, uh, someone get a little bit of, uh, WD-40 for that. Uh, or maybe just replace the thing wholesale. Um, and, uh, what we found is those yellow wires seem to be connecting to these orbs that we can break. Uh, don't know what it does, but I have been getting achievements every time I break one. So it's doing something. Uh, we just don't know what. I'm wondering if it maybe be like a, uh, a secret ending sort of situation. The thing is, is even though I found a way to get there, I don't know how to get past a, a, there's a, there's a dog who will kill us. Um, oh, if you're familiar with the game, please don't spoil anything. Our definitions of spoil are different. I'm, I will say things and speculate and throw things at the wall. I would appreciate not confirming or denying anything. Good one morning. Let's, let's do reload. It's not too tedious to get all these again. Thank you for the head pad, Aurora. Alright, 
they're gonna send us up again. Huh! Yes, my minions! Come! We must go! I'm pretty sure it leads to the orb. That's what I'm thinking. It really, I really did not think that by, by getting everyone on there. Hey, welcome to the Ziggurats, uh, 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 Hassan Supa. I don't think that dead body, I don't think they'll throw it up. But I think there's a way we can use the dead body to maybe distract the dog. We can't even carry anything with us through it. Hmm. Yup! So the question is, what have I not tried? I didn't check right. There is anything over here. Nope, it's just a wall. Hey, Samamit. Welcome on by. Yeah, fancy seeing you here. <laughs> Sometimes it's not about 100%ing on the first try. Sometimes it's about seeing how much you can do. And you would be surprised at how often things can be noticed. Because well-made games, um, they have elements to hint or to show or that there's, there is a logic behind good game design. So far, this game has been pretty well designed in my opinion. The puzzles have been varied. There's a good logical progression to them. Um, the environments have been changing. Because, like... Oh, minions. Get over here. Ah, uh, yes, our OSHA minions. So, like, this... Missable one... As I mentioned, there are the yellow wires, which seem always seem to be indicated or nearby uh, any time there is an orb, I've noticed. And we need those minions to break open this wall. If we fall down, we won't have the minions to break this wall. So it is something missable. Now the question is, can I execute? If we go through here... Nope, didn't want to go back through. Now the question is, is how do we get past the dog? I see. Is the dog afraid of fire? What the dog doing? Back! 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 I have fire! I have fire! Fear me, for I am mighty with the flame! Interesting. And now the dogs scatter. I wonder if the dogs were 
being pulled to it. Or like they were set as guardians. It only feels like the dogs somehow are also being affected by the mind control. But in a different way than the people that we've seen. Which now makes me wonder if there was a... If there's like another thing that's controlling the squid people. Sail! Alright, so I think to be a little bit more efficient, we go to the topmost because we can push the cage over and then when we go back to the middle we can grab the cage and that other dude who is trapped. And we'll get our 19 bodies. Or 20 bodies, technically. Yes, delicious sippies. Bing bong. Floor three. Yep. Sail. Now the question is, is how much longer am I going to have my fancy mind control hat? Because we might be losing it somehow in the next area, is my assumption. I feel like we're all, we've got a... If we're only halfway through, there's got to be a section where we, we have, like, a mind control fight with someone. Or, like, we're trying to control someone and they're controlling someone. Or, like, we're maybe we're trying to control the same person. This child has been carrying so much dead body. He really has. Question is, was someone he cares about on that truck at the start of the game... Or is he like, is he like Fox Mulder here to expose the government secrets and the aliens inhabiting our world? It does seem we are diving deep, deep beneath the earth. The question is, is if we're going to go like an eldritch technology ang angle or if this is like secret science government experiment angle because you know all these people are human but it seems like they're getting zombified outside of it because the people were like just sort of docile like it'd be one thing if they were thrown if they were taken to the factory and made to be, um, you know, these mind-controllable zombies. But they seem to be mind-controllable zombies before they even get to this area. Basically every office worker in movies. Yeah. Yeah, that's basically how, uh, Shaun of the... Is it Shaun of the Dead I'm thinking of? Where, like, you just see him shambling through life. Like, as a living metaphorical zombie. Before the actual zombie outbreak happens. Ugh. Bit of gunk on my controller. Alright, time to see what the big thump is all about. All right, everybody, assemble! It'd be funny if the game didn't... Like, all your people got stuck here, but you hadn't gathered everything, and then bricked yourself. 